The 80 acre piece of property was about $75,000. That was really, really cheap for a piece of property like that. That calculated out close to about $1,000 an acre. I ended up not buying it because I didn't want to add like additional expenses on top of what I already have. Like, it would be really, really cool to have my own piece of property, but it's just, I'm not entirely ready just yet. I feel like I need to be a little bit more comfortable with my finances before I really jump in and buy a piece of property. But ever since then, the price has actually dropped to like 60000 or something. Um, but I'm not entirely sure if it's still available or not. I haven't really checked. I have checked out other pieces of property. Some that were like 10 acres. Some that were like 15 acres and stuff like that. A few of them were even like 3 acres. But they were pretty expensive, so I haven't really seriously taken a look at them. But for now, I think I really need to focus on just cleaning up my shed and reclaiming it as my, my own shed. Because right now, the mice has taken over and it's just been a mess. And I'm just in that mental state where I'm a little bit anxious to see the things that I'm going to see and discover when I start cleaning the shed. Um, and so that's why I've kind of like tried to avoid cleaning it. I would prefer it to be a little bit colder too before I start working. It's just a lot easier and more comfortable for me to like clean out the shed and just do things outdoors in general when it's colder. And I know that's just an excuse, but I don't know. That's, that's where I'm at right now. <laughs>